Y'all know what time it is. It's the boxing outlet. Jack, we up in here. My numbers have been dropping just a little bit. Y'all got to start hating a little bit more, nigga. Y'all got to start hating a little bit more. Got to bring them numbers back up. Jack. Straight up. Cooking with Frank. Salute, salute, salute. Hey, your boy, uh, well, I ain't been on here at night time. I've been skipping some nights too, so <clears throat> that could be. Hey, um, your boy Shakur is not. He 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 fighting like he's scared. Why is he so scared? Why is Shakur so scared? What he's scared of? It's just a boxing match, yo. Now nah, he um that power, that boy is a, he like a Floyd Mayweather seven point oh more than a five point oh he, he like a seven point oh straight up i ain't gonna lie he ain't two point oh he's seven point oh that nigga got wings on his back he got roll runner feet he got ostrich legs he got a horse back He got a greyhound pause. That nigga was, he did good. Like to the technical part of it, how he just frustrated dude. And you know what I'm saying? De Los Santos, I thought he'd do a little bit more, but 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 I think um, Shakur ran a whole lot of miles. I think he ran a whole lot of miles um, for this fight right here. I think this was unbelievable amount of miles that the homie had to run. You know what I mean? For real. Yeah. He turned into the road runner. He was not the cheetah. He was the road goddamn runner, man. He won, though, but he knew his performance was messed up and jacked up. You know what I'm saying? Then you got the famous picture with him, Floyd, and uh, Andre Wood. Andre Wood, the weakest out of them three, and fighting to me. He the weakest up out of them three. You know what I'm saying? So, um, it's crazy. Bud, the juiciest. Bud, a little bit taller than Floyd. Yeah, a little bit taller than Floyd. That's probably why Jeff Mayweather said that he probably would give Floyd some problems in the ring because he got a little bit, a little bit of height. Do he got a little bit of reach on Floyd? That stuff crazy. I'm looking at that, at that picture. Let me see if I got it. Bring it up here. Do I, do I say this picture? Yeah, I said. Andre Ward's skills was never. I it, it wasn't like he was an exceptional fighter. Some people like Andre Ward's skill set, but to me, it, it ain't all that. Some people think that he's he's a great fighter. I don't think so. Andre Ward, uh, to me, was fighting scared. He most definitely was fighting scared. If I had to say anything about it. Wood was a scary fighter. Let's get to it. But Shakur was uh I mean at, at, at the technical we talking if we if we talking uh what uh, Mr. Moss be talking about the technical standpoint of boxing, man. Come on, man. We're talking boxing. If we talking that, the technical part like that, it was it most definitely definitely was technical, but he, he he was running more than it was technical to me. <clears throat> you 
Then he tried to flip it over and say De La Santos was really fighting scared. <clears throat> and I was like, well, what was he fighting scared at? You had the abominable snowman feet on, and you you doing your thing. Yeah. You had them abominable feet on, man, getting up out that jam. Stone Cold, Floyd shorter than all of them, huh? Floyd with all them niggas. Crawford got his juicy juice pack. Look at that forehead. He got that juice head Jackson number nine hair cream brought to you by Terrence Bud Crawford. Nah, man. She could, man. Uh, I thought it was a step up in um, in punching power for him, and uh, I believe it was. I believe he got scared when he when he found it. You know what I'm saying? When he found out that homie had that 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 that, that young power in, in them hands and stuff, I think I think it kind of hurt his feelings a little bit, but. He just played. He just played it real, real smooth. Real smooth. He ain't want no smoke. The crowd booing, booing crowd. Why was y'all booing crowd? Why was y'all booing? Was it that boring that you had to boo the man? That's crazy. That's real crazy if y'all had to boom because it was that boring. That's it's like, but what 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 Shakur was doing was he just wanted to he just wanted to fight a perfect fight, a good fight, don't get hurt. But he knew his performance wasn't wasn't nothing because he ain't standing in exchange none. He really didn't get down and get dirty with him. You know what I'm saying? When he could have got down and got dirty with him, he didn't. So you know. He feel he feel bad about that, but you know you you can only be mad at yourself, son. Ain't nobody tell you not to go out there and perform. We've been seeing some sucker stuff. I ain't gonna lie. Out of you, that was some sucker stuff. Out of uh, Jamel Charlo was some sucker stuff. Out of uh, Earl Spence, that was some sucker stuff. We seen three fighters do some sucker stuff, man. Suff sucker shit in reality. But you know what I'm saying? We seen three fighters do that. This nigga, he just, he just, he just took the dive, man. Uh Earl Spence. He just say, beat me up and stop me. Uh uh Jamel Charlo just say, I I'm just here for the check. Same thing um Shakur did, but Shakur knew just keep the distance and just outpoint him. That's it, that's all. Outpoint the man. That's it. Classic Olympic style boxing, if you ask me. Let me, let, you know, let me, you know, yeah, just outpoint the man. That's it, because that's all it's about points. And he controlled that distance so good, that nigga was like, he had a stealth radar on his forehead. That nigga was moving every time, Santa, uh, uh, De La Santa Cruz, Santos, whatever the goddamn nigga name is. Too many De Las, too many Santos. So every time he move, he moving with him. That's how you frustrate a person right there. That make a nigga mad when you right there and he swing and you take that step back and he miss. And he constantly missing and missing. And then you just catch him, boom, in between, in between punches with a little bitty jab or something. You know what I'm saying? That frustrating dude, man, because he like, damn, I can't hit this nigga. But you supposed to sell out. You just throw everything out the window and just rush the nigga, bite the nigga ill, body slam the nigga, trip him, karate kick him, kick him in his nuts, DDT him, suplex him. Every goddamn thing, put that nigga in a finger four if you got to. <laughs> 